there are a few different ways you can get map data into QGIS. So let's take a look. I've got a shape file here, which I've already prepared. It's called random shape and it's in a folder. And to add the data, I will just drag and drop the SHP bit of the file directly into the map canvas. And you can see that it loads. So that's fine, that works well. Dragging and dropping into the map canvas is what I usually do. You could also click on the open data source manager button. And then with the layer that I just added, it's a vector layer. So I make sure I'm on vector. And then in the source section, I can click the browse button. And then I just need to browse to the folder, which I've already done. And then select the SHP bit and click open and then add. And then I can close it. Now what's happened is we've got a new copy of the layer in. So I dragged and dropped one in. I added the other one with the open data source manager. And you can also add files via the browser panel. You just need to navigate to where on your computer the file is. In this case, it's on my D drive and it's in my YouTube folder in my files folder. And there it is there. And we can see it's called random shape and I can drag and drop that directly in. So that's how it works. You can add it in different ways. I like to just drag and drop for my folders, but whatever suits you best is the best way to do it.